hi there welcome back to the next video and in this video i will show you how you can create the group bar chart or the stack bar chart which is another form of a bar chart when you are having the multiple dimensions multiple measures all right so let's see how we can do that so first of all let's go into the charts and uh, let's get the bar chart and here we have the bar chart and let me add a one very simple dimension which is customer segment and let me add the sum of sales so very simple chart i have got it that for each of this segment i have the sum of sales now to create the group bar chart or stack bar chart i need to have either one more measure or one more dimension so but uh, we will go ahead with right now with one more measure uh, i'm sorry dimension so i'm going over here in fields um i already have the customer segment so what i will take is the product category i will simply drag it over here and i will add product category as soon as i add by default it creates the group bar chart so what it has done it has grouped the product category for each of the customer segment i can clearly see uh, how corporate, how home office, small business and cust consumer is uh, each of this customer segment is doing from the perspective of the product category. Now let me change this to a stack bar chart. To do that let me go into the appearance and in the presentation we have the option of creating a stack bar chart. And as you can see with this, with this uh, within the presentation having the stacked option it converts the bar chart the group bar chart into the stack bar chart and uh, if you want you can even uh, change the position from vertical which is like this tray to a horizontal if that makes more sense to you so this way you get uh, the stack bar chart from both the position or if you want group bar chart you just select this option if you want it's as it is present over here in the presentation you can enable the labels as well and you get the labels for each of the section of your segment so that's about how you can create the group bar chart and the stack bar chart into the click sense and uh, get the right analysis out for your dashboard well that's pretty much it and i will meet you in the new video with any topic